Hello guys, welcome back to another um Tuna Jaws Jaws the Tune. Don't know what we were gonna call this series at the moment anyway. Um so what I'm gonna to review today is Jaws 2, as you know. I think it's a really good sequel. I know some people think it's a wise, it's not the best, but it's a white. And I'm like, I think it's one of the best sequels ever made when it comes to though that era when the, when it comes to horror films and it's one of the first ever horror films in the 70s that pulled it off really really well because at the same sort of time there's Friday the 13th 2 and then there was other Halloween films and like you know and Jaws 2 is kind of better than Jaws 1 but Jaws 1 is the ultimate one and Jaws 2 is George 3 is, and George 4 is rubbish. <laughs> I do love this sequel, but I think it's similar to other sequels that we saw before. But this is my first ever time seeing Jaws 2 as 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 a sequel. I saw this film millions of times. The first ever time I probably watched it was 2017 because my parents and I went to another person's house for Christmas, and guess what's on? They had the Sky TV. Uh, we have a different smart TV, but they had Sky. Anyway, so what they had on the television for Christmas, in a different room anyway, so I was not really, you know. Um, so I was, in another, I was in another room, just chilling out, whatever I wanted to do, kind of. Like, you can't really do anything in another person's house, but you know what I mean. And I watched Jaws 2, and I watched Jaws 1, I think, the first time I watched it, I think it was 2015 or 16 or something like that and I was a not a big fan but I really hugely loved Jaws and then I watched the you know and it was near, it was it was near the night time and I feel like I have to watch the end of the movie and now I got it on like airplane look stopping now but uh, yeah so then I got it on the box here um yeah, the boxer of Jaws. Um, I really do like the sequel. Um, so the story is, I'm just going to say, the story is really, really good. So the opening, like the first ever bit of the film, they're opening some kind of hotel with a swimming pool. And then all the teenagers do a lot of certain activities on boats. Some of them get killed, some of them survive. You know the drill. Um, but the only major thing in this um in this story is Brody. Brody has some kind of illness or try who has a mental horrible feeling about the first shark or something like that and then he gets fired from the beach or whatever it's called when he was basically shooting nothing but just water fish or whatever it's called. Um, so that was weird. Um, I like how they do that in those old movies, but and then they say, No, you can't do this, you're fired, because this is what you think, and this is not what it is. And that's what they did when the, the character says to Brody, Okay, it's something else. And the mayor in this movie, well, it's the same actor who played the first mayor in Jaws. And I mean, like, you know, so, okay, for some weird reason, he doesn't believe him again. And he's the only one who's going to search out for the second shark that is unrelated to the first shark. That is Jaws, or Bruce, or whatever you want to call it. Um, so, I do love this sequel. It's one of the best sequels ever made. And I'm saying this is the, you know, the ultimate sequel. 
but it's kind of is. I, I don't really know. Um, but yeah, I do love this sequel, but I think it's a little bit... Ugh. Because maybe while you're watching it several, several times, not in a day, not in like several days in a week, but like, I never do that, but, you know, but I'm like, watching it several times, you know what's going to happen, but you don't feel much different stuff in it than in Jaws, because when you see Jaws for the very first time, and then the second time, and the third time, and the fourth time, you see something different in every single scene, even though it's the same scene, here, it's the same. But it doesn't really matter, kinda. Um, so that's what I thought of it. So yeah, um, I do think that they put effort into it, even though it kind of had no passion to this sort of project. It had some kind of passion, but no passion at the same time. So who directed this is not Steven Spielberg, but who is part of the first Jaws film, so some of the extra producers or whatever they're called, not the old men, but the the other young person is directed this one, and it's, oh my god, I mean like, even the music is kind of better than the first one, the, the first one this has this and then in the second one, they had the same sort of music, but it's more powerful because I think even in the plot it's kind of like oh it's you have to watch it if you haven't seen Jaws to Jaws well three ish I think they should have stopped at three but never mind um so what do you think am I wrong am I right do you think it's amazing do you think it's lame do you think it's this do you think it's that and it comes to any sort of films like this I don't know um, but I think it's amazing, kind of, but when you watch it the third time, you think, okay, it's kind of amazing, but it's kind of got the magic, uh, you know, back there somewhere, so you can't, you can't touch the magic than the, than you used to saw on the third time or fifth time or whatever, and then it's gone, <laughs> it's gone back there, <laughs> I don't know why, um, yeah, but even though there's no, sorry about that, um, even though the, because I keep in touch, you know, but even though this movie has no kind of, uh, project or whatever you want to call it, you still have that sort of feeling like they put effort into it, the same with the first one, even though that somebody said, and I kind of understand that, when somebody said the first ever George film is going to be rubbish because it's not really good, and I understand that, but we all got used to sort of this vibe of thinking it's the best movie ever made. But this is what we say about the second film, but the other way around. It's the best film ever made, but we don't feel it. Kinda. But anyway, what do you think? Uh, what do you think? Am I wrong? Am I right? Um, but I'm like, I don't know, but this is, I still have it up to this day in like Jaws 1 to 4. So Jaws 1, 2, 3, and The Revenge. So what do you think? Am I right? Am I wrong? Put, put in the comments down below with the comments are on, and I will see you all next time. You don't really see much the animatronic bits, you know, like in Jaws 4. I don't know. <laughs> um, yeah, so, yeah. It's more scary than the first one, though. Why are you still here? Goodbye. <laughs>